Hi, I'm Josh Meehan. I'm from CBS Section Street, and this is our team. Aaron Blackhall, Michael Quinn, Adam Ryan, and Amber Ayosla. <laughs> our team name is Rewind, Rewear, Remodel, and the subject we chose was greener fashion. Why do we choose greener fashion? Even though global warming is explored on the science and geography course at junior start level, greener fashion isn't. And we love fashion, and we wanted to research how fashion can be improved in order to improve our environment. Our aim was to encourage second-year students to combat climate change. We did this by hosting our, uh, our fashion show and handing out flyers. We then decided to reach a, wider, a wider audience, school community, parents, teachers, staff, and even shoppers. This is some of the research we did, and one online research that stood out to us was the Daily Mail, as it told us about child labor. This is the results of our second year and TY survey. 80% of students did not know what it was, but 20% did know what greener fashion was. This is our guest speaker, Theresa Ryan. Theresa Ryan came in with her own crocheted bags, her own clothes that she knitted herself, and jewelry she made herself. She said she uses local, uh, recyclable, and organic material. These are our five tips. Buy local, know your fabrics, and avoid fast fashion. Those three tips reduce fossil fuels. You use your old clothes, as, as you see Adam Ryan is wearing these sustainers and the dicky belt. Wash on low heat and use a clothesline instead of a dryer. This is our awareness campaign. We, we got our spot in Spin South West social medias and we got our own spot on the Limerick Leader newspaper. We also posted uh, our own campaign on our own personal accounts. And on me and Aaron's Snapchats alone, uh, we got over a thousand views. This is us handing out to shoppers our leaflet that you will see in a second. So this is the leaflet that we handed out, and it comes with the five tips that we told you earlier, and also more information that you need to know about green fashion. This is a song that now Michael and Ahmed will do. So that song was made by a fellow TY student, Tariq Markham, and we would like to thank Ahmed and Michael for performing for us. And we would also like you, we would like to thank you for watching, and we would like to thank you for the opportunity today. So thank you. Okay, lads, we have two minutes of questions. Don't forget to stand into the mic when you're answering. Two minutes, starting now. Uh, thanks for that, especially the entertainment. It was great. Thank you. Um, the hats, can you explain those before we start? Okay, so basically we wanted to do our own hats um, instead of buying a police hat. So we just decided to take green as it's green of fashion and since we're the fashion police and then we just decided to put some wrapping paper around it just to reuse old stuff instead of actually using yeah, new things. Yeah, we measured the cardboard and then like we measured the silk on top of it, you know. Absolutely. So there was no wastage? No. 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 no, 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 excellent. You could start a trend, you know that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, great. Um, so you're into fashion anyway. Yeah, massive. Um, yeah, great. Yeah, I had a old fashion show at school. Okay, and how did the fashion show go? You said that was one of your big yeah, selling we had, points. Yeah, we had actually a massive fashion show in school. Um, since, since most people know who we are as in the school, it was actually a massive thing because everyone wanted to get involved and watch. And we had it for second years in TY students, and they were actually massively involved. And before, they didn't really know what Korean fashion was, and they didn't want to know. And then straight after, they started talking to us about Korean fashion, and we started talking to them, and they wanted to know everything about it. So. And were you just wearing these outfits, or were there lots of other Yeah, things? there was actually a Manchester United jersey that we have, and it's made of 100% uh, recycled material. So. Great, OK. Well done, guys. I enjoyed that, I must say. Um, just going back to, let's say, the, um, the whole presentation and so on, um, and the various aspects that you brought to it, um, why, why did you opt for um, 
let's say, greener fashions? Why did, why did you pick that as your topic to go with from the start? Because we realised that basically buying, like, because a lot of people buy from pennies in our city, and it was just fit like it was basically producing landfill, and it was just bad for the environment. And we actually like to stand up for to global warming, so we just decided to do greener fashion. And when you were handing out, let's say, I saw the photo, the video outside Debenhams yeah. and so on, and you were handing out, I presume that was recyclable, recycled uh, leafless, recycled paper you were yeah, using, yeah. so on. Yeah, yes. I'll take your yeah. word for it. Um, but. <laughs> People that were coming along, were they kind of, you know the way sometimes people are handing out things, people walk past, they don't want them and so on. Like, what, what response did you get? Were people willing actually, to talk to you about it? Yeah, majority of the people that passed actually wanted to know what it was because of our outfits and because of the paper itself, because we have a lot wrote down on it and we have a lot of detail. So a lot of people actually wanted to get involved and like, look at the paper and even a lot of kids wanted to see it. They wanted, they wanted to get photos, photos and videos, and videos as well. So. Yeah, okay. Right, well done lads. Well Be done. proud of yourselves. Well done.